Hi, we're live already, and now we're for like for real live. Good to see you. And uh, those of you that are tuning in on YouTube, Facebook, do we have Periscope attached to this, Sean? So we're just on these two platforms. Oh, Instagram as well. Hey, I don't want to deny Instagram. So Instagram, say hello to YouTube and Facebook. Hi, good to see you. Hey, listen. Hey, it's your boy, Billy B. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. We are live here in the Elevate Virtual Studio. Uh, we got Kevin Lee from LeaderCast. He's right here. Let's spin around so you can see him. Say hi. Kevin's the man. Known him for a long time. Good, good dude. The one that basically produced uh, a lot of what you see on LeaderCast. And we're here in the studio today with LeaderCast 2020. And the theme this year at LeaderCast is positive disruption. And we thought we would have a little disruption here on Instagram. But also, we'd uh, have this new platform to talk to you a little bit about things that we're learning, like right in real time. Literally, we just got this set up. So if you're watching, tuning in, I'd love to hear for uh, those of you that are watching. we got a couple of folks that are online right now, uh, YouTube and also over on Facebook. So we'd love to hear a comment where you're tuning in from, your name uh, and then your city. I just want to say hello to each of you that are that are tuning in with us. And the reason I want to pop on here real quick and have this live is we want to talk about, and Sean can bring this up, is virtualeventsecrets.today. Virtualeventsecrets.today. Uh, let's see who we got. Who do we have, Sean? Let's tune in. Hey, what's happening? Katie Bursinger. Uh, Momen, hello. Hope you're doing well. Uh, what question do you have for me? We got Missy tuning in from Missouri. Thanks so much for tuning in, Missy. I see you're coming in from Facebook. We got a couple of folks in from YouTube. And the way this platform works is we're able to have one stream going to multiple places. And I'll tell you, we're learning a lot these days. And if you go to virtualeventsecrets.today, you can see it there at the bottom of the screen right there. I can actually point to it, Sean. There it is. It's right there. It's right there in lights. Go to that website. All the things that we're learning, uh, it'll attach you to our YouTube channel. Some of you are watching in from that. Some videos we're producing to help folks that are doing uh, live events from a virtual standpoint. And then you'll also see our Instagram. You'll see some trainings there on not just events, but how do you lead your team over the internet? How do you connect the dots when you're working from home? So we would love for you to check that out. And I just wanted to jump on live and say we're super grateful. Anybody that gives us their attention, anybody that um, joins us live just means literally the world to us. And so those of you are tuning in on Instagram, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, those of you that are tuning on YouTube, and tuning in on Facebook, I want to say what's up as well. So any questions out there for me as you're, as you're doing your virtual event? Anybody got anything they're uh, rocking and rolling? We do have a question coming in from Katie. She said, does having a professional MC or host make a big difference? Well, I would say ask the biggest and best brands in the world. That's a great question, Katie. Is um, What question um, that I ask people all the time is, you usually put your best person on the stage which that removes them from the audience engaging with people. It also removes them from their other tasks they have because they're probably doing a lot of things. Today, I've got the leader cast team. Uh, leader cast team, let me hear you out there, leader cast. <laughs> so you can hear back, they're able to do what they do best, which is to serve their clients. And so the reason people hire Elevate is so they can do their thing and we can do ours. And what we do is help people think about the run of show. Like for instance, I've got my script right here of all the things that we're talking about during LeaderCast 2020. And it was really fun to go in and watch the LeaderCast team uh, talk about the value of having an MC, but also uh, the value of them being able to take a deep breath and not worry about the quote unquote show, but serve the people that, um, that are their customers. So really, really proud uh, to partner with groups like LeaderCast that are um, bringing groups in like us, not to just do the hype or the fun or the games, which we're really, really good at. That's uh, something pe people pay us um, in a lot of different ways to serve them, to create some fun, but also at the same time, be that professional mix of flex execution and execution all at the same time. We call it simply flex execution. Uh, and so I would say hiring a professional MC, facilitator host has been pivotal for a lot of the brands that we serve. And we're excited uh, to be live today with LeaderCast 2020. So those of you that haven't checked out on Instagram or on YouTube or on Facebook, if you haven't checked out LeaderCast, go check out what they've got going on. They're an incredible organization that are really uh, poised to help a lot of people become a leader worth following and knowing their their theme this year, which is positive disruption. I'll pop it on the screen behind me. Positive disruption is their theme. So we help them think about the theme that they have and how that connects the dots uh, with their brand and what they're doing moving forward. So those of you that are tuning in, any other questions out there, Sean? We got Sean Specey. We got Los Angeles. How you doing? Aura from Los Angeles. Missy tuning in. I want to say those that are tuning in from YouTube and Facebook. We're super grateful. You say hello to Instagram. Oh, hey, Sean. there's Instagram over there. There it is. Awesome. Well, um, Billy, no questions necessarily from uh, the comment section, but we're this is behind the scenes with LeaderCast. So yep. tell us like what hap what has happened so far today that's behind the scenes that you can give us some insight into how to run a virtual conference or event. Yeah, it's my favorite part 
about events is what's happening behind the scenes to actually make it happen. We actually, before we went live right here, we had up on this screen, Beastie Boys, uh, the documentary. And if you haven't seen it, I haven't seen it yet. Just watch the trailer. We watched that. And it's amazing. They didn't stop the camera. They just told the authentic story. And then we watched right before that, Justin Timberlake and Chris Stapleton do say something and they did it in one take. And if you go to YouTube and Google it and check it out, but they did this song that was super complex and did it in one take. There's a lot of a lot of moments where mistakes can happen and things don't happen the right way. But behind the scenes this morning has been, we arrived really early this morning, set up the virtual studio that you see kind of here behind me. And the leader cast team came in, they brought all their computers and connected to Wi-Fi and hardwire tuned in and get all their, their things ready. So they're in another room right across the way here at our studio. And then you got Ben who's right over here. Let's pan the camera over to Ben so you can see him. He won't <laughs> move, so I'll move it for him. There's Ben right there. He has a lot of words of wisdom. You could tell he's very, and then tuning in this way. Let's see if I can turn the camera swing so. all the way, all the way, all the way. And there I am. For What's sure. up you guys. So this is the command center behind the scenes for leader cast. So we have our mixer, we've got our video switcher. We have our computer that's streaming. And what we're doing over here is I'm actually watching the live stream. So I'm controlling the banners that you see on the screen. For example, if you want to learn more about how we think about the event experience, you can go to virtualeventsecrets.today. You love the fact you can hit that switch. I right actually there. hit <laughs> it. I hit the button. It's on the screen, but I'm here on the screen too. I love it. So we're learning a lot just how we help and serve our clients, right? Sean, we've got a lot of ways mm -hmm. we're doing that. Like, And I'm learning that I love seeing behind the scenes. So just turning the camera, like turn the camera over on Kevin Lee. He's dancing. <laughs> you can't see him back there, but... He's too close to the camera now. He's too close. <laughs> oh, there it is. But I just think people are craving more authenticity, more fun. But Kevin, can you do that dance move on camera over here? He's probably not going to. But um, partnering with groups like LeaderCast and organizations that are bringing us in to help them bring some levity, bring some fun, bring some professionalism to the game has been really, really cool. And so if you're a group out there that's saying, gosh, I would love to have Elevate come in and partner with me on my next meeting. We had a group this week, IHG, International Hotels Group, that uh, brought us in for a 45-minute meeting. We brought in their head director for this group that we work with, about 70 people on the call. We brought in their chief technical officer. We gave them four or five minutes to speak. And then we just did some interactive games to have fun with them. And it was really fun because their chief technical officer was so blown away that we were able to connect the dots on chat, have fun with the people, do some giveaways, but also share some meaningful content and encourage folks during this pandemic was really, really fun. And had a call the next day about multiplying that within the organization. So whether you're tuned in over here on Instagram or whether you're on uh, YouTube or on Facebook, I want to say if there's an organization, we want to do as much as we can to pump as much creativity and passion out there through this website. We can pop it up again for me, Sean, is uh, virtualeventsecrets.today virtual event secrets out today. If you've not been to that website, I want to make sure you go there. See, it's right there, right there. There it is right there. Go to that website and go register for one of our trainings. Go check out some of our event tips we have there. And also if it's something you're really interested to talk more about, please, if you would just reach out to us, uh, we would be honored to have a conversation with you because this brand behind me, this elevate logo, this brand, our, our goal really is to help people live and lead at a higher level. This is a wing. It's also blue. We believe in blue skies and blue oceans and helping people that are really trying to figure out what's the next step for me. And actually, we got a really great special right now. We have a handful of spots for us to come in and do an event for you at no cost. All right. So this is live so I can say this. If you are a brand that's saying, I would love for Elevate to come in and do a 30 to 45 minute event for my organization. And we actually have a few of these that we're giving away at no cost just because we want folks to taste what it could be like to have a professional company come in and put on their meeting or their event. So if that interests you, go to virtualeventsecrets.today and uh, register for a call. We'd love to connect with you. And I hope you're having a great day. So in the comments, any other questions out there in the comments? I'm taking a look right there. I see Ricky Spalding is tuning in. What's up, Ricky? Hope you're doing well. I've got a hello here on Instagram from, from Mula, I believe. We got Beast Season, which might be the coolest handle on Instagram of all time. Katie, I'm going to give some waves out there. So if you're not following us on the grams, if you're over here on, on YouTube and uh, you're over here on Facebook, make sure you go follow us over on Instagram as well at Elevate Experiences. But um, we did have a question, Billy. Ricky said, should people still have weekly virtual times to connect with their team? And what does that kind of a virtual event look like? I had a terrifying answer to that question from someone I talked to about three or four weeks ago. And they said, we just stopped all team meetings during the pandemic. And I paused for a second and said, wait, wait, wait. You stopped all your team meetings. Tell me more. He's like, yeah, we really didn't have any updates or anything to say. So we just stopped meeting. And for me, 
And I think for probably 99% of the world out there, that is the most important time to connect. I know technology and what platform do you use and is the camera turned on and my audio doesn't work and my Wi-Fi is down. There's a bunch of complexities that have been added because of the pandemic. But I think now more than ever, and Andy Stanley said it earlier on LeaderCast, the session, uh, if you haven't checked it out, make sure you go to LeaderCast 2020 and go watch the session from Andy. Um, he shared the story of Sandy Hook Elementary School back in 2012. You guys remember this, when 27 people were murdered um, at an elementary school in Sandy Hook. And he talked about how um, President Barack Obama, whatever politics you agree with or not, that's not really my concern. Uh, but Barack Obama could have easily uh, sent a letter to each person, could have easily called a meeting with all the families of the kids there. The oldest person that got killed that day was seven years old. Um, I have a, I have a six, seven and eight year old. So this story hits home with me and he paused and he said, I'm going to go there in person and I want to go meet with every single family. And he shares a story of going and hugging every single family and really just embracing and say, Hey, tell me about your daughter. Tell me about your son. He was very present with his voice in that moment. And I think meeting as a team does the same thing. You're able to see people and connect with them. Uh, we do our very best at Elevate to have a meeting each and every day with our team to sort of hear updates. And sometimes it's, you're meeting every day, it feels a little laborious and you're kind of saying the same things over and over, but there's something special that happens when teams just communicate gratitude or something they're thankful for or something that they're working on. We get to press through that. And uh, there's a phrase that I use a lot is that distance creates suspicion. And I think anytime you're away from a, a person or not in the same environment, whether it's in person or virtually, I think that can happen. So, so I would say find a rhythm, could be once a week. We meet, we meet every single weekday from Monday through Friday. And um, so, but I would say find that rhythm for you. Once again, those of you tuning in, really appreciate those on Facebook and YouTube for tuning in. And for those of you that are tuning in on uh, Instagram as well, I'm gonna say bye to Instagram. Much love to y'all, I appreciate it, holla back. But those of you that have tuned in on this brand new platform that we're using here, I'm, I've been messing with Ben all day long to see how close I can get to the camera, see if he can zoom it in. Hi, no, that's, that's my tipping point right there. But uh, we're trying brand new things and I hope you are as well. So I'm just super grateful for you. Um, we've got the ticker going across the screen. What does it say? Learn how to create an event your guests and employees love. Visit Virtual Event Secrets today. Sean, paint over to Sean. Look at Sean's face. What? He's loving this new piece of technology that it's allowing us to do that. I mean, Sean, how do you feel right now? Well, and what's fun about this is like we're behind the scenes at LeaderCast and we just learned how to use the ticker. We just learned how to bring multiple people on. You can zoom out a little bit because Billy's right here next to me. If we can get him in the shot too. Maybe, maybe. No, maybe. six feet. I got to be six there feet away. Six, well, you're yeah. six feet away. <laughs> you're six feet away. But behind the scenes at LeaderCast, we're learning how to use this new software. And this is a great event principle. Earlier today, when we were using this for LeaderCast, we tested, I literally took a laptop and went in the other room. Right now, this is our first time using this for our own Facebook, for our own YouTube. And so now that we know how to use it, we want to use this to create a different, um, we can do, use this regularly. Yeah. We signed up for this today and this is our first time using it. And so it's, this is a test, but it's also still behind the scenes yep. for LeaderCast. And there's an element of research that we all must do for platforms that we use, but there is a point where we're just like, Yep. You just got to turn, the camera, turn the camera on. on. You got yeah, to go for it. So, so yeah, so hopefully this has been encouraging for you that even as we're learning some things fresh, we're going to send it out there. So on YouTube, we're putting out videos each and every week about things we're learning in the virtual event space. But also when the pandemic is finished and prayerfully, that'll be sometime in the near future, all of these principles and ideas will carry over to that as well. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Uh, look at the question in the comments. Matter of fact, if you're still on here, tell me where you're tuning in from. I got anybody in the building that's tuning in from anywhere. We had Aura from Los Angeles. Aura from LA in the building. Thank you for that. I love it. We've got, let's see, Missy. Missy what's happening? Is that Missouri? Yep. From O'Fallon, Missouri. O'Fallon, Missouri. Very good. Love it. We had Katie from Jacksonville. Katie from Jacksonville. I love it. I love it. Thank you guys all for tuning in. We're going to do more lives like this in the near future. And I will do as much value to, or much as we can to add value to you. So thanks again for tuning in. If you haven't checked out LeaderCast 2020, we're going to jump back in live over there. So go to LeaderCast on LinkedIn, on YouTube, and on Facebook. We're going to be over there doing some fun interactive games coming up here in about 48 minutes. So at uh, 1245 Eastern Standard Time. So once again, go check out LeaderCast. But the reason I'm doing this live is to tell you about virtual event secrets today, which is on the screen, right? Well, it's scrolling. And yeah, now it's on there. there. It is. <laughs> it's scrolling and it's there officially. So uh, virtual event secrets today. Go to the website, go register for a training and uh, we'd love to serve you. So thanks for tuning in. Bye.